question that we get asked almost every single day, why is my seat keep slipping? I have the quick release tight. It doesn't move, it doesn't slide, but whenever I go for a ride, at the end of the ride, I put the zip tie on here as a, as a height indicator, uh, but at the end of the ride, my seat post is much lower than when I started initially. Your quick release is loose. Now, oftentimes I hear, well, when I close the quick release, it's very tight, you know, it leaves a mark on my hand. I'm not able to push on it. You know, I can jump up and down and try and get, but it doesn't move. So what do you do? You know, why are you telling me that it's loose when clearly it's not loose? The forces that we put on the bike while riding are different than the forces that we put while the bike is at rest, right? If I push down, it's not gonna move. But if you notice with just a little bit of lateral force, I can move the saddle. And as we're pedaling and each leg is moving up and down, it's driving the saddle a little bit this way. And then you add on top of that, the body weight that is forcing the saddle in the downwards direction. Well, as I twist when I ride and also the downward pressure will eventually cause the saddle to lower during the course of a ride. The easiest uh, and obvious solution is simply open the quick release. Always make sure you open the quick release first because we do get a lot of customers that say, I cannot adjust it, it's already tight. I have to use a wrench. If you open the quick release, it releases all that pressure that's binding the, the seat post and it makes the, the little um, knurled nut on the opposite side much easier to turn. You can see I'm turning it much more easily with my hand. Um, what you want to do is when the quick release lever is open, give it a good half a turn to a whole turn and then close the quick release again. The easiest way to test to see if your saddle is securely uh, tightened, the quick release is tightened, is just give it a little twist. If it still moves a little bit, just open up that quick release again, give it another half to whole turn, close the quick release and test by just trying to rotate and now I can't I can't twist it anymore. That is your indicator that the quick release is sufficiently tight.